NHS Improvement has issued a patient safety alert on the risk of severe harm or death due to withdrawing insulin from pen devices. Pen-shaped devices are commonly used by patients to inject themselves with insulin. Different types and makes of pen can contain different concentrations of insulin, but the device automatically takes the strength of the medication into account, ensuring the correct dose is injected each time. By contrast, when a healthcare professional injects a patient with insulin, rather than using a pen device, they typically use insulin syringes and insulin vials which always contain strengths of 100 units per milliliter. For a number of reasons, patients may become unable to self-inject insulin as normal, for example if they become unexpectedly ill. Where this happens, a healthcare professional may be required to use a patient's own pen device to ensure they receive the insulin they need. This can happen both in hospitals and in the community. In these situations, staff may find they are unfamiliar with how to use insulin pens and may not have the right equipment to safely remove a used needle attached to the pen. This has led to instances where staff have used an insulin syringe and needle to extract medication directly from a pen or refill cartridge. This should never happen. If extracted in this way, because of variations in the strength of insulin in different makes and types of pen, it can easily lead to a fatal overdose. It can also damage the pen cartridge, potentially leading to further dose errors. Staff need to know how to safely use insulin pens and need the right equipment for their own safety, including new safety needles and sharps boxes, suitable for removing and disposing of used pen needles. If training and equipment has not been provided by your organisation, and your role could involve caring for patients who use insulin pens, you are encouraged to speak to your manager and ask why.